Hey, Dave, here is your wife out on the golf course doing chipping, so I want to go over this. First thing I notice is she's standing awful far away from the ball. Tell her to try to stand up a little bit, and the weights to the left is fantastic. She has her hands forward, fantastic. She's got her feet together, but just try to stand up just a little bit. She doesn't want her hands about... She wants them almost touching her left thigh, not seven or eight inches away. So as she goes back, keep the weight on the left side. Very nice. Very nice way not to flip your hands. Now, you can see at this point, though, the weight's back here. Make sure your weight stays here, dear and turn the belly button slightly to the target. See how you turned it a little bit after? Try to do that through the shot. Try to turn, as you hit the ball, try to turn through, keep the weight on the front foot. Don't lean back to try to lift it up. Just keep the weight on that front foot. Really nice with your hands. That's a great way not to flip. You didn't do any flipping with the wrist. You didn't rotate the face of the club. That's great. Just really lean your weight into that left leg and let the belly button help you a little. See how you start to turn it right there, but the ball's already gone. Now your weight's on your front foot. But at this point back here, right here, you can see your weight's on your back foot. There's more weight, and I know you're on a hill going up, but really keep this left knee flexed. Don't let it straighten. Okay, chipping looks good. Remember, it's a putting stroke with an iron. Okay, depending on how much carry you have in relationship to roll is whether you pick a seven iron or a pitching wedge. Okay, very good.